Hello everyone, here we have this Philips Avent baby bottle warmer that we've been using with our Dr. Bronze bottles for the past three months since having our firstborn child. I love that it's compact, lightweight, and perfect for smaller countertops and may be even be used when traveling. As you can see here, it has a specific instruction that says to ensure water level matches the milk level in the bottle and the water must be at room temperature. I think this leveling takes practice because I initially struggled, but after a while, just like putting on a baby's diaper for the first time, you eventually get the hang of it. Simply place the bottle in the warmer, fill the water reservoir with room temperature water, and select the desired ounces by turning the dial and pressing the power button. The warmer will then turn on the light, as you can see here, until it completes a full circle, and that's how you know it's ready. This Philips Avent bottle warmer heats the bottle evenly, and automatically shuts off when it reaches the desired temperature. After it's completed, I always make sure to check the temperature on the back of my hand. I usually do three drops on the back of my hand just to make sure that it's the right temperature. As you may have noticed it, I'm using a Dr. Brown's bottle. This Philip Avent warmer claimed that it may work with other leading brands. Well, honestly, it has not been working so well with my Dr. Brown's bottle. Sometimes I get the perfect warm milk, other times milk is too hot or it's still too cold. So I learned a few tricks so I can continue to use this warmer. Sometimes, I would set it at a lower ounces than what's in the bottle. For instance, if I have four ounces of milk in the bottle, I would set it to three ounces, or other times it works by taking out the bottle too early before it even completes the cycle. And other times, if I know I'm going to leave the bottle in there for too long, such as when I'm giving my baby a bath, I would usually set it to one ounce regardless of how many ounces of milk I have in the bottle and then shut it off so when I come back to fetch it, I know it's not too hot. As I was making this video, I realized that with eight ounces of milk, it actually doesn't work. So I really have to buy a new bottle warmer once my baby reaches the age where he would need to have more ounces of milk. Overall, it's not the best for my Dr. Brown's bottle, but I'm keeping it since I've already invested three months and have learned a few tricks to make it work for my baby's need. Thanks everyone for watching. Until next time.